to another developing headline, and this one causing real alarm for millions of American shoppers. Tonight, new concern about a security breach, this time at Home Depot. And it could be bigger than the breach at Target. In that case, 40 million customers, their credit card information stolen. How the numbers could be even larger this time, and what should you do? ABC's chief business correspondent, Rebecca Jarvis, now. Tonight, Home Depot confirming they are working with banks and law enforcement to investigate some unusual activity that could put millions of people's credit card numbers in the hands of criminals. We know that the sale of both credit and debit card numbers are proceeding in the black market. The potential breach involving all of Home Depot's 2,200 U.S. stores and possibly online purchases would likely be even bigger than the attack over the holidays on Target when thieves made off with 40 million credit cards. Security experts say the best way to reduce this fraud, embedding chips like this one into credit cards. American retailers plan to launch that technology next year, but it's already in use in Europe. When they introduced chip and pin cards in Europe, it decreased the amount of in-store fraud by 60%. Over 60%. But analysts caution it's not a silver bullet, with 226 million Americans shopping online each month. Bottom line on that is that Chip and pin is not going to help you when you shop online. So how can you protect yourself now? Check those credit card statements regularly and consider using apps like BillGuard, which monitor your accounts 24-7 for fraudulent charges. And David, tonight Home Depot tells us they are rapidly gathering facts. If there is a breach, they will immediately notify customers. No one will be responsible for any fraudulent charges on their accounts. And Home Depot will offer free services for identity theft protection to anyone who's been impacted.